Daryl's Tire and Service Center has been in business with the same owners for 25 years in Vaughan, Montana. And for 20 of those years, this small family business employed a bookkeeper named Jenny Whiteford. Jenny was the stereotypical trusted employee with full access to the tire shop's financial accounts. And if you don't see what's coming, I'd like to welcome you newcomers to my feed. Of course, Jenny began stealing. She wrote company checks to herself and covered it up in the accounting records as legitimate business expenses. This is why every company, no matter how small, should segregate access to the money from access to the accounting records. Two different employees need to be handling those two tasks. In addition to the check fraud, she was skimming cash from the daily deposits. Jenny kept this up for five years and stole $140,000 from the tire shop before the owner stumbled upon the theft and called his bank who looped in the FBI. The case was small for the FBI, but it's Montana, not Manhattan, and small police departments aren't often super excited about financial crime cases and are thrilled to defer these matters to the FBI. For her part, Jenny didn't put up much of a fight at all. She pled guilty to fraud charges and was just sentenced to 10 months in prison, which seems kind of light to me, but I'm no judge. Plus, she has to pay restitution to the tire shop when she gets out. And God help her if she gets a flat in that town. Let me know what you think about this case in the comments, and then have a great day and be cool.